Welcome back to our series on optimizing your project management process with Draw.io for Jira. Hey, my name is Emily, and in this video, we'll explore how you can make your sprint retrospectives have an effective and meaningful impact on you and your team with the help of Draw.io. At the end of each sprint, it's crucial to capture valuable insights, reflect on what went well, and what areas need improvement. The sketch team is going to start today in Confluence and then later move to their Jira Epic as they want to make sure that the lessons learned during the retrospective are easily accessible throughout their project. To start, the Scrum Master creates a dedicated Confluence page for the retrospective. She adds the Draw.io macro to the page, opens up the new editor, and begins creating a template that will ensure a smooth retrospective experience for the team. Once she's done with the template, she invites her team members to the page. And now they can all come together inside of Draw.io to note down all of their ideas and feedback in real time. With Draw.io's live collaboration in Confluence, the team can actively participate and build upon each other's insights, promoting an environment of continuous improvement and shared understanding. Within the retro template, the Scrum Master created an area specifically for important lessons learned, as well as action items that the team decides they want to move forward with. It could be a reminder to include a profanity filter in the AI emote creation process, or a note about the need for additional training in Python to complete certain tasks along the way. But why use both Confluence and Jira? Why embed the retrospective diagram into the epic? The answer is simple. It's all about ensuring that the lessons and action items from the retrospective are not overlooked or forgotten. While you may not embed this diagram in each individual JIRA ticket, embedding it in the EPIC provides a central place for members of the team to access and review the retrospective outcomes. It serves as a constant reminder of the important lessons learned and guides the team as they work on tasks related to the EPIC. We're almost at the end of our journey with our friends at the fictional live streaming platform that we've named Sketch. We followed them through their entire project planning process, first with a brainstorming session, then when they structured their project plan, and now when they look back on all their hard work with a retro. Make sure to subscribe now so you can join us next week as we watch the engineers of the Sketch team as they process support requests submitted by the users of their newly released AI-powered emote creation feature. Thanks for watching and keep up the great diagramming.